in Bully Beatdown news. Bully oh, Beatdown. I love that show. I miss it. How come they don't bring it back? That's a show? Yep. Yeah, All with right. Jason Mayhem Miller. What do yep. they do again? Tell me the... It's an MMA fighter with a bully and they go fucking head to head and they fight. They I really like when they can... The, the bullies actually think they can take them down. It's dope. Oh, it is the I best. I saw this one with the bodybuilder guy. He got fucked up. Eddie Alvarez. Was it that he one? He fought Eddie Alvarez. And Eddie Alvarez had a blood rate that ball. All those guys are like, I yeah, they could see. fight. And they're like doing curls. I'm like, what the fuck do curls have anything to do with fighting, you morons? It was morons? amazing. He, like, Eddie Alvarez like roundhouse this dude in his yeah. chest. Yeah. It's like oh, 90s, oh, yeah. early 2000s MTV, right? Uh, it was mid 2000s. Mid 2000s. Yeah. yeah, it was pretty back in the day. It yeah, was it was cool. fun. I love that show. I'm gonna Especially on like the guys that know a little bit of kickboxing or something. And then it's like, dude, you're up against a pro, man. Yeah. Imagine if he turns out to be so good, they're like, we should probably offer you a contract instead. <laughs> I want to see one like that. I haven't seen it like that. They weren't just like regular pros. They were like UFC pros. They were like really good. Yeah. Jake Shields, Eddie Alvarez, they are like yeah. the top guys. It's such a cool show to be a part of. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Oh yeah, they had Andre Olovsky. Jesus. Like imagine if they hit you up like Bart Joe. Hey, we want you to be in a show where you beat up old school bullies. Like, I think you guys would love it so much. Old no, I'm not even, I would like send me a way to go oh, train for three months so I could come back and kill someone. Cause right now I can't beat anyone. I need more training yeah. too. Yeah. Okay, like maybe like elementary school bullies. I like that you yeah. like really think so highly of them. I'm, I'm super down That's as amazing. long as they're not Samoan kids. She's a best friend to both of y'all. I hope you That's know. very nice. In of my you. eyes, you guys are. I find it highly fighters. offensive. I wasn't even involved in this conversation. <laughs> I'm like sitting right yeah. here. I He's like bigger that. than me, G Gina. <laughs> I completely forgot. I forgot David was here. <laughs> and this bitch over here, she's like your best friend. I'm still right I'm here sorry. too. It's the camera's blocking you. I think that's what happened. I don't even know what excuse. And then he said something and then he like appeared in the room. I'm like, oh shit. Where'd you come from? I'm one of the guys. <laughs> I have no excuse. I don't. I saw it. Haven't you seen his Instagram? David's been boxing. Oh, David's right. been training. Aesthetic ass videos in your Instagram. Story. David. Yeah, he's so training. artsy. Let me tell you something about those videos, though. It takes a long time to make that shit. They're artsy. <laughs> they're great. Because I'm doing it with like three different apps. I'm just like, fuck this shit. For real? But I like the way it looks. I didn't yeah. think you put that much work into your Insta. Well, actually, no, I take that back. Never mind. I fucking know how much work. Yeah, you come on now. <laughs> Yeah. He um, beats you at you your own more, game. I know, he puts in more effort than I do. I, I like I like uh, Insta Story because... Um, Insta Story? I need to start called? doing that yeah. more. Yeah, I like Insta Story because it's just, um, it's like vlogging with no pressure. Yeah. Mm. You know what I mean? Yeah. I love it. So, As he sits there stressful at his at three hours. But even then, I somehow <laughs> turn my I somehow turn my Insta story Insta story into something very difficult. Yeah. yeah. You know, yeah. it's just how I am as a person. All right. Uh, in Bully Beat Down News, submitted by Gina's Twitch follower. Oh, hey, what's up? Um, a follower. A father was arrested after he beat up an eighth grade girl in retaliation for bullying his daughter. Whoa, 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 whoa. Are we talking? Whoa. I mean, <laughs> wait a minute. A dad beat, a dad down dad down beat up an eighth grade girl. Yeah, but like, is this like, is this girl like a Samoan? She's pretty big. I mean, way. it's still an adult versus a child. Yeah. I think that's ultimately. Uh, and it's a male, a man. Maybe not. Eighth grade boy or girl. No dad should be beating up an eighth grade. Remember those right, girls we adult. saw in Hawaii in the supermarket? They were big. Our fans at Foodland, oh, shout yeah. outs to you if you're watching. Oh man. Y'all were tall. You were taller than me. If you're Polynesian, I think it's a fair fight. No, 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 no. Oh, adult. Right. And children should never. But what if fight. it's a five foot five Vietnamese adult? No adult. Adults know better than to fight. They use their yeah, intellect. Yeah, I mean, I like like I like the reason why he did it, but he shouldn't have done it. I'll put it to you like this: uh, the guy that trains me now, he like he does jujitsu competitions. He said that there's this guy that this kid that won so many like jujitsu like competitions, and he was like 16. He goes, I'm not gonna handle this kid. He said he got his ass whooped. <laughs> Oh, yeah. He said he got his ass. <laughs> These kids are really good. But he, like, he said that kid's been training since he was like five or some shit. You know what I mean? So yeah. it's like it within his like family or whatever. I don't know. But that's pretty crazy though. A 16 year old could whoop a fucking older guy. Is like it that. true that when you lift when you're super young, it stunts your height height growth? Uh, no? no. Oh, okay. Mm. Okay, then those fucking boys in school lied to me. Then you guys are just fucking short. But it also depends. It's where they got their information from too. You yeah. know? Because I used to think that too. They probably got it from their Asian grandpa who knows nothing about lifting. Mm. What about mm -hmm. coffee? Does it stunt your growth? That I don't know. Because well, that's anyway, a chemical this, thing. It's like caffeine. Yeah. I don't know what does your body at a young age. This dad, his name is John, 33 years old. He was charged with injury to a child uh, when he got physical with his daughter's bully. So they were, John went was with his wife and they went to the school to talk to the vice principal and 
In the middle of them talking, he told them that he parked his car in a fire lane and that he needed to move it. So when he went to go repark his car, that's when he saw the bully girl and he went to the bathroom and brought a uh, Slammed her head against the bathroom wall. That's oh, no. To the point where like she got like a bump on the back of her head. And so she went like That's they didn't wrong. find out until she went to the nurse's office to complain. He needs to fuck up her parents. Yeah. yeah, yeah. See, yeah, yeah, yeah. that's that's right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah. I, I wouldn't fuck up a kid. That's like that's like if there was a bad dog and a bad dog bit my dog. I'm not fucking up the dog. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Maybe if it doesn't let go. It's like a lot of I'ma fuck ago, up that, that owner too. When there was when you're out and there's like this girl mouthing off to you, she's not in danger. It's her boyfriend that's in danger. Oh, that's right, that's right, yeah. that's right. So it's like the more you talk, the more all these people here are gonna fuck your boyfriend up. So mm -hmm. Yeah, because like before the before the whole vice principal office thing, he was he got into a verbal altercation with the bully in the hallway and that's when police had to come like the campus police came and separated them but then he went and go, he found her in the bathroom some people don't understand consequences okay, well, uh, oh he's og though yeah i was San thinking Antonio. like i was thinking like a all-american yeah that's what i was thinking too cardigan tied around his fucking you know oh, like a mr rogers dad fucking up a <laughs> yeah, how dare you mess with my children but then when you see a cholo you're like Duh. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got to represent. It's because he couldn't, he, he changed his ways when he had a kid, but it came out. He was like, you're not fucking on my daughter. Oh, I thought you were going to show me a video. No. That's it? That's it. Oh, damn it. There's no video. I usually I, tell you if it's a video. I like the <laughs> intent, but maybe not, like, you, you shouldn't attack a child. If it wasn't illegal, I might do it. Do you think it'd be cool the other way around? So yeah. let's say a mom goes into the boys' bathroom and fucks up the boys' bully. A hundred percent. I just said no to adult fighting children. Okay, so maybe that would mention the kid too. He's gonna be bullied even more because the haha, your mom is fighting, you're fighting. Oh, yeah, and the mom goes and fucks that kid up too. It's like, haha, your mom. Yeah, keep on talking. My mom's right there. I got my speed dial, homie. What I? Yeah, scary moms. Maybe like not beat him up. Maybe just backhand him a little bit, like. I think it all depends. If you have a four foot two Asian mom, go for it. Throw the chunkla a little? Do it. Fuck him up. Because I wouldn't mind beating up a kid. Okay, maybe not beat up. Spank the <laughs> shit out of him. Yeah, but if you're like, you know, 6'5 and like 200, you know, like you're just built, you shouldn't, it's too, it's too much power. Okay, what if your dad is like six foot four, buff as fuck, and he goes into the school, he doesn't beat up the kid, but he's like, hey, come here. Lay over my lap right now, and you spank him in front of everyone. That's not beating up a kid, right? But you're still yeah, embarrassing him. The There's still like physical contact. But and shit. spanking is not beating. Like it, that's different than slamming her face into a no, wall. That's sure dangerous. Different. Yeah, I'm you know. Like, parents still gonna get in trouble though. For spanking and man, we shouldn't. We, we shouldn't get in trouble for spanking other people's kids. I yell at other people's kids. In every school, there should be like a boxing ring or a cage. Mm. And um, you know. I I think I just like the mafia method better. Where what it's like, you've just done some crazy ass shit, so you have that reputation. So all you gotta do is you go to that school, hey, hey, come here. Let me talk to you. And then you just tell them a couple senten sentences, and then that kid just turns fucking white. Aww. And it's like... That's what my dad used to do. That's too intimidating. That's dope. My dad then you don't do anything. Why fear? Like you have to realize, in order for that to happen, you, want to beat happen up? you have had to done some crazier shit. To adults, though. But you do it to adults, So you have to, to put an ice pick through someone's eye, and yeah, then you yeah. come to school and say, this isn't a fish eye. Because there was like certain kids in school that were untouchable, because not because they were tough, it's because who they knew were really yeah, tough. Who connect, how connected they were. And I That's fucking dope. hated those kids. Because they could say whatever they wanted, <laughs> and they would like take other people's lunch money and shit, but you what couldn't touch bully. them. Oh no, but I would, but I, like, if I would discipline my own so that they also have respect, yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to be fair. My dad used to do that in school. He would go to school and just pull out like the biggest or most popular guy, and then he'd always go to his side and whisper something, and they never told me what he said. But I think that's what it was. <laughs> mm. <laughs> what if it was something nice like, Hey, your hair looks so great today. <laughs> you see that girl right there? That's my daughter. It would mean the world to me if you just and he slipped some watch money. her back. Yeah, he yeah. probably said something like that. And but then like, said, like yes, one sir. kid went up, like one kid I asked him, like, what did he say? He goes, he started peeing in his pants? Nothing. And I'm like, no, really, what did he say? He just would not tell me. Till this day, I still don't know what he said. He probably said something really weird. He's like, I will, I will open mouth kiss you. <laughs> <laughs> Open mouth kiss? Can you imagine? The, you know how my dad looks. He goes, I will open mouth kiss you and speak Vietnamese at the same time. <laughs> <Yeah>. No, man. 
<laughs> what if his threat was like, you know, I will sing every song from Paris by oh night. Oh my god. And give you a private one-on-one -on -one performance. And the Asian kids knew, they're like, no. no. <laughs> I will turn up the reverb in the karaoke machine. I will tongue you and keep my eyes open the whole time. Oh. oh. I will uh, my dose. No, jammer. like when Isaac would, when he was in the playing in the playground and he was really li little, and I would see little shit bag kids like being little shit bags. Mm -hmm. I'm like, fuck, how do I handle this situation? I've never been in a situation yeah, what like this. Yeah. I go in and I say, hey, you don't do that. Yeah. Don't do that. And I hope to God the fucking mom's around. Come be like, yeah, you're fucking animal. Put him on really? a leash. Yeah, yeah, you're yeah, so yeah. level headed. I would grab sand just. Throw out his face and like, damn, the fucking wind is crazy. Wow, around. I must so be a bad to, parent. You have to be like, you can't do what that. What I ended That's up bad. doing was just removing Isaac from the situation. I'm like, I don't want to talk to other people's kids. Like, I don't know whose parent this is. And then, like, some of these kids, their parent would be like, way the fuck oh over my there. God. They wouldn't be watching their kids. Yeah, you know, I've done that before. I'm like, whose no, kid is this? There's ways to like, like. like Punish Who's kids without people knowing. Like simply, like, like the sand, just, right? Sand and blame the weather. That's, that's a good one too. There's also this thing too where you have them all play football and you're the quarterback and you just chuck oh it fucking God. hard at the kid. Let's all play yeah. football, guys. I was like, hey, Jimmy, ready? Flat! <laughs> Boom! And he gets hit in the face. Whoa, why were you looking? Yeah, don't you fucking do that buddy. again. You missed, buddy. You didn't catch it. <laughs> There's a lot of things I learned at church. <laughs> I love how you're learning how to abuse children at church. That's oh, like you know what I learned in military ever. school, which is dope? You could shake the fuck out of someone with a fork and it hurts like crazy but it leaves no marks. Wait, what are you talking what? about? Or like plastic fork? No, like a metal fork, right? If I got a metal fork. I don't want to be your example. I'm oh, not. you said shake. I yeah, thought you said shake. If I start shaking the fuck out she of her, it shake. hurts. Oh, yeah, shit. It, hurts like it, it doesn't leave a mark. It hurts like crazy. What do you mean, like you hold it up and you shake it? Yeah, and you start stabbing him. It hurts like crazy. Shake. No, not no, shake. 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 I shake. shake. Too. Like stab. Shake. Like S H A N K. Yeah. Beef shank. Are you sure it doesn't make it? Doesn't, doesn't No, we've done it so many times. <laughs> no. Yeah, we've done it so many times on these kids. I just like yelling at other people's Wait, kids. Wait, what kids? The same kids at the school. We used to run no, that shit. Fools oh. that would step out of line. They're fucking selling ecstasy. We're you guys supposed are to be violent. Selling. I would just watch play basketball. I, last with them. week uh, we had um, we were we were in a store with Tofu the dog, and then fucking uh, oh, not the person. <laughs> yeah, I know a guy named Tofu. Not the food, you know? I know. I know a guy named Tofu. That's why. And um, this lady, she had like her son. Her son was like one of those fucking kids. Like, yeah, let me touch Ugh. this. Let me touch that. Ran over to Tofu and tried to grab her tail, and I was like, hey! And like, I had to shove him out of the way because Tofu hates when people come up to her. And if she bites him, then that's her fault. Like, they're Why gonna blame her. Why would someone grab the dog's tail? Because he's fucking stupid. Oh, he's like a six year old kid that was dumb. And I yelled at the mom, I was like, hey, you need to come get your kid. He's trying to grab the dog. She goes, ah, again. And then she just comes over and grabs her kid. I'm like, you wow. fucking I hate suck. parents like if that. If you yeah. had a football on you. <laughs> Let's play football! <laughs> exactly. Play football, the man with all the frisbee, answers. anything. Play baseball, but don't give him a bat. <laughs> it's great. I'm just gonna carry football everywhere I go now. Yeah. Self-defense, football.